Welcome back to another of Iron 4 Cold War Iron Curtain episode again. We're trying to keep it as historically accurate with problems we're going to have to deal with Lil Kimmy's grandfather or great grand No, it's his grandfather over there in North Korea dealing with that conflict, but also dealing with the PRC war. And we are going to be actually lin leasing as soon as we're able to to try to help defeat communism. It's going to be mostly historic, but we are again going to try to keep it as historically accurate-ish as possible. But... We're going to do some stuff like maybe try to take North Korea. So anyway, don't forget, if you guys enjoyed today's video, don't forget to subscribe and like, because it helps me out. And let the bombing commence. Or not. Alright. Oh, I can hire Albert Einstein! Oh, and he's a nuclear scientist. I feel like that's not historically accurate, but I'm going to do it anyway. Oh my god. Alright, I'm just gonna say it. I think the American Air Force is kind of doing a little bit more than it should right now. <laughs> oh, and there's Korea. Alright. Sweet. Oh, I didn't even have to do the encirclement. The AI did it. <laughs> Alright, well, why not? I guess I'll attack. Oh, I forgot about these. Up oh, and now I need to mute it so I don't get sued by PBS. I can listen to their speech or what does? Oh, that does not. Oh, no, nope, there's Mao. Oh, so South Korea does the focus so I can naval invade the north. All right, that's interesting. But where's Inch? Oh, it's in their own territory. And they've also recaptured Seoul. They're, I'm not even doing anything. I'm just sitting in the back. So hopefully that they'll bring in the Chinese and we can actually have a Korean War this time. Do it. Oh, and there's the Inchen invasion. Okay. But they're not supposed to be here. And they're exiled. Which makes no sense. Okay. Oh. And... One Korea. Oh my god, that factory output. I didn't even see that. Oh my god, the consumer goods. <laughs> uh, not gonna lie, I'm actually really concerned about the factory count difference right now. And the plane count difference. Oh dear god, am I losing the Cold War? I'm noticing some really suspicious things about the Soviet Union. Number one, their focus is that they're researching the high-speed bombs, sir. Second off, they're going partially reactionary. And third off, they have some kind of national spirit that is negative 1,000% required for sending volunteer forces? Okay. You know what? You guys came here to watch something interesting. Historically, they just issued a diplomatic objective. But, what if we give them the ultimate... Uh-oh. Hmm. Oh, boy. Oh, I can't believe I just did that. Oh, oh we won! Ha 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 Okay. Alright, it's been nine years. I've had enough. Uh, okay, canceling that, going down the Chinese Civil War route, I'm invading PRC. So now, let's do quit, we're on China. Oh yeah! Nice. And now we got a level 4 port. No, that's a level 6! Oh yeah! Wait, where, what? Oh. Oh, I launched these way too early. Oh my god, the paratroopers are actually able to hold them. Well, mostly. <laughs> oh, this is such a cakewalk. This... This is unfair. Ooh, airbase. Oh my god, if this works, this is gonna be a nice encirclement right here. Oh, yes. Oh. Things be kicking off in a. Nope, they're still monarchists. Never mind. Well, the invasion's going well. Now, it may look like I'm falling back, but actually, it is a tactical withdrawal. It actually is. I'm gonna trap their entire army. You watch and see. Oh, yes, give me that free territory without even having to fight for it. Yum, 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 y
Now, where's their capital? Oh. Okay. Goodbye, Chinese tank. Even though it looks Russian for some weird reason. Ooh, this is working. Nice. Ooh, that's nice. I wonder how many casualties have been sustained in the war. I feel like Germany invading the Soviet Union right now. Oh my gosh. Oh, please tell me I'm about to encircle. Please. Oh! Oh my god, another big encirclement thanks to the Americans. Ooh, yeah. Well, actually, largely the French on that one, but since there is no such thing as the French army, I'll take that win. Oh, now their capital's up here. Oh. Oh, I won! I won! Oh, yeah! Mm. Oh. America. Or, well, sort of. I don't really know how you could call this America. Ooh, 95% world tension. That means I can start turning on nukes. Ooh! You know what? I think I'm going to make him my puppet. We're good. Oh, that guy is not Chinese. Well, guess I'm in invade Cuba to test out my nukes. Oh my god, the B-52 bombers range. Okay, I'm going to be able to hit anywhere in Europe. Especially when this one gets upgraded. Ooh, wee. Alrighty. And go to war with Cuba. And check and see if I can do any of those things yet. Draft. Oh, now it works. Okay, that's cool. Wait, so there's 1.3 mil. Oh, it takes out the civilian population. That's something the base game don't do, son. Oh, snap. It's now 100% world tension. Uh-oh. Get the nuke, get the nuke, get the nukes, get the nukes ready, get the nukes ready, get the nukes ready in case the Soviets gets a little gutsy, get the nukes ready. Wait a minute, they weren't guaranteeing their independence, were they? Oh, okay, we're good. Whew! But I am gonna justify on them now. I maybe committed some more crimes. Hey, hey, maybe went a little bit overboard. Hey, hey, did a little bit more than I should've. Hey, hey, but now, guess what? It's a democracy. It's my philosophy, Hakuna Bratata. And we got us a supply route. Awesome. Sweet. And once we get this area, then we can start moving up even more. And I'm going to cancel everything so I can work exclusively on repairs. Oh my god, it's all damaged. Like, bad. Oh, we're winning. By like a lot. Ooh! Oh, dear go- Ooh! I missed a spot. And it's only gonna be the Union of Soviets that gets nuked, because they had this coming. Ever since that stupid y'all to betrayal. This is all your fault, Stalin, rolling around in his grave. All his fault. All of it. The, <laughs> the irony! Of me getting the Peace Corps as I'm dropping nukes. <laughs> nukes. <laughs> and now all the bombers. Except for that one. Target Central Russia. Oh, yes. And daily. How we doing? Nice. And looks like the Soviet Union's army is almost gone. Oh my god, wait, that's mostly it right there, I think. Go down south, go down south, go down south. I don't know what else I would have to capture. Archangel, I knew it, I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. Uh, oh, Romania. Let's open those to Soviets. Well, Mongolia is gone. Who got, of course, China. 
It's funny how it's funny how this doesn't even have a name. Manchuko doesn't even have a name. Yeah, it's um you kind of go in the way of the uh, Adolf there. I'm not gonna lie, Khrushchev. Kind of uh going to the doomsday weapon theories now. I don't even. Oh my god, it's gonna be that one little town. It's gonna be like that one little town is all I need, isn't it? It's just like, yep. I need one victory point. That's probably how much that town is exactly, isn't it? And then, come on. Come on. Come on. This is going to take a while. Bada bing, bada boom, and... Yes! I've won! I've restored democracy to the world! Oh, okay. And this is how World War III ended. With East and West Germany still being a thing doesn't make much sense to me JFK is alive he has destroyed communist what is this huh wait the Union of Sovereign States <laughs> that's great well I won that was a great game